Hi, welcome back to Lockdown Diaries. Continuing with the series on looking at my grandfather's war diary and his actions in the Second World War, um, 80 years on to the day. Today is a fairly short entry, but it gives a little bit of an indication as to what was being faced at the time of the Dunkirk evacuation. Today's entry from the diary of Ronald Walker, Thursday, 23rd of May, 1940. Woke up early a.m. at Dover. Sailed and arrived midday at Calais. Shelled by Germans as landing. Enemy seven kilos from harbor. Force consist of one Brigade King's Royal Rifles, 2nd Battalion Queen Victoria's Regiment, 1st Battalion Rifle Brigade, no artillery support. Seven kilometers is not a significant distance, especially for the enemy to be closing in on essentially all sides. The Rifle Regiment arrived with no artillery support, it was just them. They were short on equipment, and the equipment that they did have wasn't up to the task. Looking back, it must have been impossible for those men and boys, really, to truly understand what they were facing. They'd been told that they were prepared and that they were ready, and then when they deployed onto the streets of Calais to take up defensive positions, they were defending against tanks and aircraft with just rifles, and yet they held it for as long as they could. Tomorrow, I've got another update with more information about the next day and what they faced.